Let's see if all this was successful. Fingers crossed. Um, that looks good. I'm in the right place. And the stuff I did last night is done, is still there. Okay, let's go, uh, let's go wander around. Hello everybody, this is Theron. Welcome to Minecraft Land Party and its new home. So a few weeks ago I got a notification from the company that I used to host the Minecraft Land Party server saying, guess what? We're gonna we're gonna shut down. The company's just gonna go away. Which is uh it's too bad. So um because, you know, I, everything was all set up and it just seemed like it'd be a pain in the butt to, uh, to do anything. So I had to find a new hosting provider and um, <clears throat> found one. Um, and I, am, I did some testing with the test server and uh seemed to work okay and then i i spun up a new server for the main world here and i want to make sure everything's okay so um yep everyone's whitelisted so that's good um Already turned on. Good. So we're whitelisted. Um, I've got the world backup from the old server loaded in here. And let's go wander around and see what time is it. Uh, it's getting dark. Okay. That's, that's fine. So we have to test a bunch of different things. Everyone's still here. Llamas... Got ruin stuff up here. Probably go into spectator creative mode to do some of this. Just because. And but that should be all wheat up there. Let's go up here. Uh one nice thing about the new server host hosting provider. Is that they offered uh, some nice, uh, some nice features that the old hosting provider did not. So okay, I'm okay with that. So, um, spending a little more money for it, but should have plenty of resources on the server itself to uh to work okay let's go into the nether make sure this is all connected up right okay came out where i expected to test all these portals <clears throat> I expected to end up good. This will probably all be fine. Um, one thing I'm going to want to do is see if I can find any unloaded brand new terrain and see see if uh, make sure that I don't get any weird chunk of boundary errors. Go over here. Let's go and check out the gold farm, make sure that it still functions. 
This would be the one thing that I'd be most concerned about. Huh. Hello, little dude. Oops, I didn't really want to pick up all those. But we'll we'll stick around to make sure that some some piglins actually come through the portal. And throw these swords away. <clears throat> I wonder if I should build a little smelting machine here to uh, to throw the swords into. So I'm running, still running spigot 1.18.2. Next step after I check to make sure that all this transferred mm. over correctly is do the update to 1.19. And then I want to install a couple other uh, data packs. So I'm running a few data packs from the uh, Hermitcraft server, the uh, multi, the single player sleep uh, data pack is probably the most important. Um, there's a few other small ones, mob heads, and um, what else? Yeah, mom heads and a couple of things like shulkers the the one that causes shulkers to drop two shells instead of one okay something's coming through the portal there i've got gold and zombie flesh so they are dying on the bridge in the overworld which is the important thing i mean it means that they are on the bridge in the overworld that's the important thing let's wait another minute and hopefully we'll actually see some picklins pop through the portal itself <clears throat> come on anytime now guys <clears throat> there's obviously things there there's obviously picklins there because they are dying in the in the portal frame So this is working. I'll have to uh, team up the barb. Oh, there we go. Hello, sir. Okay, good. So that's good. Um, team up with barb. Have her AFK in the overworld at the appropriate point. Up there. See, they all despawned when I came through the portal. E immediately. All right, so let's go check over here to make sure that this is all as expected. I don't see why it wouldn't be. We'll go back in the nether, check out all the other portals. Yeah. Good. My sand collection area. All right. Let's go back over here. Double check all the villagers, make sure they're all still there. Good. Don't see why they wouldn't be, but just want to double check. Double check everything. Ow. Okay. Hi, villagers. Yeah. Okay, everyone's good. Everyone's good. Our villagers over here. Okay, good. No disappearing villagers. Back into the nether. Villagers there. I'm going to have to take some of these villagers and move them over into the other ground area. Uh, build a villager breeder and an iron farm over there. 
That is definitely in the cards. So now from here, let's go do the far-flung ones first. Then we'll head back over closer to spawn and see what we get. So let's go check out. Um, definitely need to make sure the end is still the way it was. Um, but here's Barb's beach house. Ah, oh, yep, this looks good. Ooh, what are those pillars? She... What are those pillars? Let's go upstairs and see. Are they holding something up? Or just a spider farm? Interesting. I'm just probably working on this. Uh, desert village over there. Hello, parrot. Oh, and an ocelot. Hey. All right. Back down. Back into the nether. All right. So, next up, we have Vex's, Vex's village. We have the mob farm. Oh, I should eat. Um, mob farm, the end, Barb's village, Barb's cavern, uh, Lorax's place, and the end, of course. So let's go out to the mob farm first. That's the farthest out, and then come back and go to the end. When I sleep, it'll put me back on the Mushroom Island. Okay. So the end is here. Let's go past this. Go out to the mob farm. Sure, this appears to be functioning. And there's some mobs. Yay. Okay, good. Let's go check out the end. I should also check out Spider Farm and the Skeleton Farm. This is all looking good so far. Hello, Cal, you're still there. Yeah, this all looks the same. It's good. Dragon did not respawn automatically. That's good. All right. Put me 
back here. Go back to sleep. Okay, let's go back into the nether. And go check out the spider farm. Spider farm's over here. Had an interesting thing when I spun up the server. It automatically started on the latest version of Minecraft, vanilla. It's not what I wanted. Um, and it generated some terrain, I think. Hello, spiders. Come to me. Um, and then I changed the seed. <laughs> and then I spun up that I... I Started the server and then jumped into the world. Hello, spiders. Okay, you're all good. good. Okay, let's get out of here. Um, <clears throat> and there were some wacky generation things. Uh, and I think it was just because I changed the seed after it had already generated some chunks. So I don't expect there to be a problem with that here. But if we can, I would like to go out. Okay, so Vex's village is here. I'd like to go out and run around a little bit. Exploring to see if we can find some new stuff. Vex's village looks normal. Good. At this point, I think if the portal's link, we're probably okay. So he's got villages in here. They survived the transition. Gotta eat again. Um, <clears throat> all the farm stuff is up here. Hello, kitty. Yep, farms. And I gotta build farms like this. I don't want them to be auto farming necessarily but eh, maybe maybe eventually um so i need to build some of this stuff some of i already got in the mushroom area but some i don't um i don't have anything automated or very little automated and i want to get some bees uh, i think i have a bees nest already with some bees in it and that'll let me get started um. Okay, back to the portal. And back into the nether. I'm sure his house is just fine. It's right over there. I can see it. So then we have Barb's Cavern. Make sure this links up. Hello. Yep. It's all here. Back into the nether. Okay. Let's barb to village. That's a bit of a lag spike loading in, but village is here. Yeah, this all looks normal. It's 
skeleton farm. Submit to make sure it's working. Oh, I see. I see. Skeleton spawned right there. Sucked into the into the tube. Yep, and they're coming. Okay, let's go. They're not all gonna die. No, no, this couple survived with the fall. Let's get back into the Nether and check out my base. Check out my starter base. Ah, oh, somebody left the door open. Hey, cookies. Giddies. Sure, all the dragon stuff is still here. Yep. And make sure my valuables are still here. Yep. Make sure the outside is still here. Yep. Our lovely valley. View distance seems better here. I don't, maybe I'm just imagining things. A horse. Okay. Uh, I'm not gonna. All this stuff should be fine. <clears throat> Just check on the iron farm. Don't need to go all the way down to the slimes. Yeah, iron farm is working. Okay. Let's go check out Lorax's place. And then I need to make sure that that nether fortress is still there. Then I'm going to go and cheat. Go and create a fly around a little bit. Find, hopefully find some new terrain. Make sure that nothing gets gooky. Our excellent place is over here. Portal. What's he doing over here? Deep dig. He's got a little minecart thingy. Let's see exit as Oh the cow farm. Wheat going. Okay, so looks like he intended this to be a villager to farm it. But I don't see a villager. Oh, he's got one or not. Okay, well. Oh, he's expanding. Oh, this is kind of neat. I like this. It's a little dark under here, but uh, so this is like a little keep area. Let's see. Oh, wow. Huh. All right, well, this is kind of cool. Snooping. It's got a little spyglass there. 
stare it makes me claustrophobic. Up into the rafters here. Oh, and it goes up further. On the roof. Oh. See where that uh, rail line goes to. Oh, it keeps going up. Uh, he's got a copper ceiling. Okay. This is an interesting uh, design. Let's go back. How do we get outside? Sun's starting to go down. I don't necessarily want to deal with nighttime. How do we get out of here? Ah, here we go. Okay. Rail line. He's got this going out over here. Paired portal there. To the jungle. And it just kind of ends. I bet he's still working on it because this isn't even powered. So this is a village over here. The horse. Of course. All right. So, oh, this is a neat little jungle village. Oh, dangerous jungle village. Okay. Okay, so. Well, everything seems to be fine here. Let's go up a bit. So I am at 190 minus 836. Huh, neat little village. I don't know if I've been here. So let's go minus Z. Let's go negative Z for a bit. And get away from here and see if I can find some new territory, some new terrain. What is the going on down here? Huh, what's all this netherrack doing here? And then this is a big whole cave. Oh wow, this is a cool cave. Okay, well. Another village. See if we can get into some generated new new terrain. Um, and if there's a problem, I will presume that I will see it as kind of a chunk edge error, like a chunk boundary that's super obvious. It's another little village. More 
ocean. Ocean. Is this being generated? It might be. It's a lukewarm ocean. Yeah, I think this is being generated as I go through it, so this is okay. Seems all right. What's this? Oh, shipwreck. Oh, shipwreck. Oh, cool. I should wander out this way a little bit and see, explore a little bit. I might be able to find some, uh, some treasure. But I have other priorities. I need to clear that um, ocean monument that I found. Oh, yeah. I, I think we're okay here. Let's go out to 4,000 just to uh, be safe. Then we'll go back home. Yeah, I think we're okay. Oops. Okay, well, so this all looks good. I think we're okay. So now I need to switch over to 119, test that. And then I need to update the, the data packs that I'm using, make sure that they're on the current version. And uh, Lorax would like to have the uh, armor stand, the advanced armor stand uh, data pack, which I can do. And let's see here. Yeah, see, I've got all that extra RAM. A lot of it's being used. And things are pretty darn smooth here. So that's, I think that's a good sign. So, okay. Well... I think we're okay. I think we're going to be fine. Um, so, yeah. So, I'm going to end that there. And we will... I'll do some other testing. I'm going to... I have some other things I need to take care of today. So, I'm not going to do it all right now. But that's a good test so far. So, we're another step towards getting back... Getting the server back up and running and getting everyone back on. So... All right, well, thank you very much for watching. This is Theron. It's been Minecraft Land Party and testing edition. And I'll see you later. All right, bye.